Hello guys, this is Cricket from Nerd Society. I just got this box set today. It's for Lord of the Rings, the extended edition. The box set looks really nice. Um, the lettering is even embossed. So it has textures to it. And I like the weather look to it. It looks kind of old. It follows in the similar style of the extended edition for the DVD with the packaging where it's kind of thick and has that vintage look to it when I unsealed it, it also came with this describes how there's 15 movies or 15 discs total including the digital copy alright let's take a look inside first thing you see is the map of Middle Earth which is pretty damn cool I mean, you could follow the travels of Frodo Baggins and Aragorn and the main characters. Here's a picture of the main characters. And it's pretty thick, the packaging. It won't break or anything. It's very sturdy. Alright, so first, try to look at over here. You can see that there's three cases for it, one for each movie. Let's take a look at it one by one. So sort of the ads that came with it. First one is the Fellowship of the Ring. Notice it says Extended Edition. Let's open it. So over here is a little booklet that's similar to the one that came with the DVD version. Over here is the first one. So each movie comes in two discs. And notice how it says Blu-ray right there on the left hand side. So this is part one. Part two. And I believe most of the extras are in standard definition. It's just DVD. But what we care mo most about here are, is the presentation of the movies. And it should be great in HD video, 1080p. And it's in also saw in DTS track, so HD that is, so it's lossless. So that's the first one. Second one has Gandalf as the main picture in it. Same thing. Blu-ray. Blu-ray. DVD. 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 Last but definitely not least is my favorite one, Return of the King. Well, I don't know. Fellowship of the Ring is pretty cool too, so it's hard to decide. They're all great. So, same thing. A little booklet. Blu-ray. Blu-ray. DVD. DVD, DVD. So once again, the extras are in standard definition DVD, while the movies are presented in HD. And also the packaging. It's black, the Blu-ray case. If you compare it with a regular Blu-ray case, it will really stand out. So that's a pretty cool touch on WB's part, trying to make it special. And it works. Looks really good. So what I'm going to do is pop in the first one right now. To find out if the green tint is there that some fans have been complaining about. So while that loads, 
just want to show you guys a little bit of my home theater setup here's my LG 55 inch 3D TV my Polk speakers my den and receiver and it's loading right now by the way I got posters of Fight Club to my right which I bought for 15 bucks at Blockbuster and Kill Bill to my left which was for 10 bucks alright so it's playing right now that's the intro right there The sounds are pretty awesome. I could already feel the bass just from the intro. So it looks like the menu is similar to the one for the DVD version. Um, this is where I'm going to stop it because I'm going to focus on the movie. But keep in touch through my website. I'll give you guys my impression whether the green tin is really annoying or if it's really there. And thanks for watching. Once again, this is an awesome set. And the packaging is definitely impressive. Alright guys, I'll talk to you guys later.